All right, so we are going to talk about the two things that you need to do before you launch your awesome, super amazing brand on the next iMogul TV. Stay tuned. Hello and welcome. My name is April Ray, CEO and founder of the Introvert Mogul Studios. Thank you so much for joining me. So we have been talking about creating your brand, designing your brand that reflects all that is you. You are having fun. You are creating something that is going to be working for you 24-7. So speaking of 24-7, in my earlier series that I, the, that I first started was how to automate your business. Now, this is essential. This is why I started this first, because you want to have your automated system set up for when you launch. You wanna have people, people are gonna get curious, people are gonna to come to your sites. So you wanna make sure that you have your email autoresponder set up, whatever system you're using. If you're in MLSP, um, you have that set up to your capture pages. Um, if you're not in MLSP, you have created some sales pages using something like lead pages or click funnels. And now you're ready for people to start coming to see your amazing brand. So that's the first thing you want to have set up. Make sure that you have that all tight. Make sure you have your autoresponder series and letters that you want to have for people that come on board to your email list. Okay. Um, like I said, if you're MLSP, they have that created for you and you can just sort of tweak it so it sounds like you. If not, if you're not in MLSP, then you just create your own story and you just um, create letters for the people that are going to be landing um, on your list. The second thing that you want to do is you want to start creating some buzz around your brand. Even though it's not finished yet, it doesn't matter. You want to start, or even if it is finished yet, you don't want to launch until you start creating that buzz. So you're going to create posts on Facebook, Twitter, wherever you hang out, wherever your target market hangs out, because we did that during your branding. We defined that during your branding, right? You want to start making posts something in the effect of, I'm super excited for what's about to launch. Stay tuned. Follow me on Twitter because it's about to be huge. Now, people are going to be really excited about that. People get excited about stuff like that when you post posts like that. They're like, wow, what is it? What are you doing? Right? They want to know what, you, what you're doing. You can create images of your laptop and you working at your laptop and saying, I'm about to explode my business or I'm about to up level my business or take my business to the next level. Follow me, stay tuned. And people are going to do that. They're going to be waiting to see what you have in store and they're going to get excited. Um, you can even start creating, getting more people to friend you. There's so many things that you can do to start creating that buzz around your brand so that when you do launch, more people are going to come to your website when you start to show your link. These are the times when you get to show your link because it's not going to any kind of a sales opportunity. Nobody cares. It's going to something that 99% of the people in your niche probably don't even have, okay? You are ahead of the game if you've already created your brand, you've created your website, you have, and you're excited about it, you love it, you you feel proud, and people are going to get to know you, and there's so many more things that you're going to be able to do once you have that all set up. All right, so the two things you need, make sure your automated system is set up, and then start creating a buzz on social media around what's about to launch. Okay, so that's it. I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, please leave a comment box and share it with your besties. And if you're on YouTube, make sure you uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel, okay? All right, so I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye for now.